channel if you are new here then i'm so happy to meet you i'm so excited for today's video because it's the start of a brand new series to my channel which is my holiday series but also how have i not addressed the situation look i got red nails i never have red nails i'm not gonna lie they're kind of giving me like christmas vibe which i feel like is kind of inappropriate considering this is episode one of a holiday series wow Gemma. little series that i've created is so much more than just a series to me this is something that i feel so so passionate about i finally feel like i've got like as cringe as it sounds got my mojo back oh i can't believe i even just said that but i feel like i've had like creators block for the longest time i just haven't really felt very passionate about anything for a good few months and this little holiday series that i've planned i'm just it's like my little baby, like I'm so, so excited to share it with you guys and I hope you love it as much as I've loved creating it. It's basically gonna be a little series that's gonna last for four to six weeks and I wanted to just include loads of like summer holiday type videos to get us all like excited for our summer holiday this year. Or if you don't have a summer holiday booked this year, just a little bit more excited for summer. To hopefully give you guys maybe some like outfit inspo, some makeup inspo, maybe no inspo at all. So I thought I'd start this series, thank you piece of hair, <laughs> in true Gemma Miles style with a big Primark haul. We all have a bit of Primark, if you saw my video on Bank Holiday Monday, you would have seen that I went to the biggest Primark in all of the land and it was bloody amazing. I picked up some really lovely bits so I thought I'm going to show you guys what I got and then I've also got some bargains from H&M as well. H&M's holiday stuff is insane. You guys already know the drill get a cup of tea get snacks get on the sofa get super comfy and i really hope you enjoy episode one <laughs> without further ado i shall shut up so my loves the first item that i picked up from primark was you're actually gonna laugh because if you watched monday's video i mentioned that i cannot pull these off but i thought you know what i'm gonna try a little bit something new this summer i got a hat you hear me talk about this all the time. I do not suit hats. I've got some kind of like big ass head that doesn't even fit in this little hat. On holiday, I know it'll be an absolute godsend. You know, for those days where you don't want to wear any makeup, you know, you literally just want to chill. You want to wear big sunglasses. I thought, do you know what? This to hide my face on holiday, be amazing. Or like if I'm sunbathing and it's a little bit too hot, I could literally just put it over my face with maybe like a black bikini, a black cover up, big black sunglasses, all black everything. It actually might look quite nice. I'll keep you updated as to if I actually wear it on my holiday. Obviously, you know there's gonna be a holiday vlog. We are gonna film loads of videos whilst we're actually on holiday. So we'll see if this little guy makes an appearance. So next I picked up this absolutely, absolutely stunning, if I do say so myself, little lilac bikini. I thought this is gonna look insane with a tan like i actually even tan on holiday i have to fake tan because i'm my my skin is transparent literally pale person problem but i actually have this in black and i love it so much that i bought the lilac version got the top in a size 10 and it was six pounds and then i got the bottoms in a size 12 and they were four pounds when i bought the black one of these i got the bottoms in a 10 and they were a little bit too tight my usual size is kind of like an eight to ten. Nine would be like my ideal size. Please bring out a size nine. Please, Lord, hear my prayer. But I would say size upper size in the bikini bottoms because they're the kind of bikini bottoms, if they're slightly too small, you end up having bulges in places that you didn't even know was possible to have bulges. And it was slightly depressing when I put them on and I looked like the Michelin man, so yes. Size up in the bikini bottoms, but £10 for a bikini is absolutely fab. I've just realised the sheer amount of shoes I've got again. I have a severe addiction to buying shoes. I don't need any more shoes, but I just can't help it. They're just so cheap and nice, and I'm like, I need them all. Let's do shoes, then clothes, because I'm too excited to show you now I've seen them. Primark sandal game this summer is incredible the first pair i picked up are just these crossover almost like a slider type sandal they're rose gold they've got little diamonds on the camera doesn't really pick up 
how gorgeous they are but they're so sparkly they were six pounds they will literally go with everything perfect for you know the evening the daytime i'm not really one for wearing heels on holiday I always take a pair and they literally stay in my suitcase. I don't even take them out of my suitcase because I just think after a long day of lounging about doing nothing, the last thing you want to do is put a pair of heels on. So I think it's like a staple to have a really nice pair of sandals that you can get away with wearing in the... Like you can't be wearing Adidas sliders down to dinner, really, can you? Well, you could. The next pair of sandals I got are just... Oh my gosh. Just look. I feel like the universe gave me these sandals. I feel like I visualised these, asked the universe, and the universe delivered. Because I'm actually speechless. I'm actually speechless over a pair of sandals. I'm so in love with them. I, oh, I just love them. And they were £8. Okay, my white shirt is like progressively getting oranger and oranger the more it rubs on my body. <sighs> the last pair of sandals I got from Primark until we go on to H&M and then I've got two more pairs are these gorgeous flip flops with just a little diamante, diamante, ooh, diamante detail on here. I thought they're really, really simple, perfect for day and night. I've just realised I've got wide fit and my feet are like the narrowest things on planet Earth. Like they're actually like ridiculously thin, my feet. They're honestly about this thin, maybe not that thin, but they're not... I shouldn't have got wide fit, but hey ho, they'll be absolutely fine. And these were six pounds. If you watched Monday's video, you're gonna know what this is purely for my reaction just then. When I saw these in Primark, I nearly cried. I'm pretty sure I shed a tear. I shed a tear in Primark. Oh my god. Oh my god. Haven't guessed by now. I have an obsession with Dumbo. The new film is just, oh my god, I love it so much. I love elephants as well, so Dumbo is like my favourite ever Disney character. And if you watch my hauls, you will know I completely rave about these night shirts. They're like five or six pounds. They're so long. I always get mine in a large, so it's like it literally comes down to my knees. They are just the comfiest little things to sleep in. Really baggy, they're really long, they're not hot, they're perfect for the summer, so... Oh my god, I'm absolutely obsessed. I would say this is definitely my favourite thing out of the whole haul. Love you, Dumbo. Next, I picked up this little three-pack of scrunchies. Primark is the best place for scrunchies. They always have such nice designs, and yeah, they're super cheap as well. So £2 for a three-pack, and there's like... And they're all different types of leopard print. I just thought these would look super cute with either like a high pony, top knot, or something just to like throw your hair up on holiday. Got another Dumbo top because I, I couldn't resist. I promise this is the last Dumbo purchase, but this was six pounds. It's a cute little pajama top, but there was no pajama bottoms. Was a little bit like kind of distraught about it, not gonna lie. Okay, I'm gonna be sneaky sneaky and save those two things to last because they're just amazing picked up this oversized beach shirt i love cover-ups i love kimonos i love beach shirts i love something to throw on over your bikini i think number one they look incredible for pictures on holiday like let's be honest gotta get that holiday instagram post they look incredible kind of like draped over the shoulder undone oh my gosh they're also perfect just to throw over a bikini if you want to go grab a cocktail you want to go get an ice cream or you're going for a walk go into the water park Basically, if you're moving from your sunbed, they're great to throw on. I bet anyone else, but does anyone else get like poolside anxiety? You know when everyone sat around the pool and I don't know, you just feel so exposed, don't you? Like if you get up and walk about, you feel like everyone laying on their little sun lounges is like, probably because I do it to people, like I people watch on holiday, so. I don't know, I just feel a little bit more secure in my cover up. So this was eight pounds, I got it in a size large because I wanted it to have that oversized fit and I thought this would look so good with an all black bikini, black sunglasses and the black hat. And then next I picked up almost like a white version but this wasn't actually in the swimwear section. This was in the clothing section um, and I got it in a size large so it had an oversized fit but it's pretty much exactly the same as the black one. So if they don't have what you're looking for in the swimwear department, it's worth just having a look at like the oversized shirts or the oversized t-shirts and you can always use those as a little cover up anyway as well. Okay, so the next two items you guys are absolutely gonna adore. I couldn't believe it when I found them. You know when you've been thinking of an item of clothing for so long and then you finally find it, I was like, oh my God, this is my day. Absolutely incredible. Little ivory silk top, oh my gosh. It's so beautiful. I mean, you're gonna have to see this on the try on clip to see it fully, because I feel like this really isn't doing it very much justice. But it's a high neck. You know I love a high neck. 
the sleeves are just gorgeous they're like flowy and then there's a tie detail at the bottom 10 pounds and i got it in a size small they do look like it's going to be quite oversized anyway my thoughts for this were like evening wear on holiday or maybe not even on holiday just like summer evening wear like going to the beer garden going on a night out i thought this would look beautiful with a pair of high-waisted leather shorts now i know what you're thinking like leather in the heat yeah they're gonna get pretty sweaty but they're gonna look gorgeous and i also picked up the champagne version this color is everything i am so obsessed with whites and champagnes and ivories at the moment like i just think they are the most like beautiful palette of colors i think they go with every single skin tone oh my gosh i just i love them so much this is exactly the same as the ivory one i was thinking maybe with this one wouldn't this top just look gorgeous with like a high-waisted pair of white shorts hair up loads of highlight a nice glowy peachy lip and then rose gold sandals oh my gosh that is definitely gonna be one of my holiday outfits i feel like i actually might just live in that outfit the whole of summer so my loves that is everything that i got from primark didn't get loads this time um because i want to kind of wait until a little bit closer to my holiday because i want to get my last minute bits from primark and i've bought so much from primark in the past few months i feel like i pretty much have all of their stock um so moving on to h&m h&m have got some gorgeous holiday bits in at the moment i find h&m very very hit and miss sometimes i can go in and see so much stuff i like sometimes I can't see anything that's what hit and miss means Gemma you don't need to explain so my first little purchase from H&M was actually something that I've wanted for a really long time and these are just some plain black wide leg trousers I got them in a size 8 and they were $19.99 these are like the baggiest look how much material there is on one leg I mean that is a baggy trouser but I really just wanted a pair of these for you know one of those days you wake up it's really hot you're a bit bloated you don't feel like having your legs out you just want something to throw on look nice effortless and be comfortable like my main thing about summer clothes is they have to be comfortable I can't stand being hot and wearing something tight or feeling uncomfortable and all irritated like I have to be comfortable so I thought these would just be really really nice like as a black and white outfit maybe a little white crop or you could also wear a black and white striped little top with this I think would look really really nice maybe some black sandals black sunglasses just an easy summer outfit you get sweaty like you would in the leather shorts no 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 because they're like airy they're breezy oh she got another pair of sandals shock horror i got suckered in again and i'm just really loving a gold sandal so these were eight pounds 99 is that croc or snake print i think it's croc but they're just like a metallic -y gold color they also had these in black and silver and i think there was a bright color no there was a snake print color of these which were really really nice oh my god take three wild guesses what i got from h&m next hmm some more sandals okay i mean there's only so much i can really say about a pair of sandals but I really just love these. I thought these were kind of like for me everyday wear. Like in the UK, on holiday, wherever. These are just everyday wear. I feel like they'll go with a lot of my clothes. Like I usually wear a lot of plain clothes. Like whites, nudes, blacks, champagnes. That's pretty much where my clothing colours end. And I just thought leopard print would go with everything. I love the big bows. Um, and they also feel like really, really good quality. So these were £17.99. A little bit more expensive than the others. But... I just I really just bloody love them got a big old beach bag I actually struggled to find a beach bag that I liked and when I saw this I thought right that's the only beach bag I've bloody seen that I actually like so I need to get it really like the size of this I feel like you could get a towel in there I feel like you could get a lot of a lot of unnecessary things that we all take down to the pool in there put my book in there my headphones in there my sun cream pretty much my whole life will go in that bag and it was 12 99 which I actually think is a really nice price for like a really good quality big bag. Also, forgot to mention, Sunday's video is actually going to be a come holiday shopping with us. So we take you around all the high street shops and show you like all of their new in summer stuff. So H&M is one of those shops. So if you do want to see what's new in in H&M, then that video will be live on Sunday. Okay, everyone, I'm currently holding the swimsuit of dreams. The swimsuit of dreams how gorgeous is this i'm absolutely obsessed sophie actually got the bikini version of this which you'll see in which you'll see in sunday's video as well because we did like a little mini haul at the end but this is honestly just going to look so stunning i feel like with a red lip maybe some like little gold earrings a white kimono oh my gosh loads of glow 
<sighs> like an actual island queen. So I got this in a size 10 and it was 12 99 which I actually think is really good price for a nice swimsuit. It's got a plunge neckline and adjustable straps. We all love an adjustable strap. Okay, so next from H&M, I just got a load of accessories. So first things first, I got these little flowers. You can't really see them that well on camera. Let me take one off. Oh my gosh, how cute. So I thought in the day, sometimes you want to get your hair out your face. I just thought a white little flower would be like so holiday-y. Summery, Gemma, not holiday-y. And I actually posted yesterday a look with these, like a really like super glowy, natural, easy holiday look. So... If you want to see like how I styled these, then I'll leave my Instagram in the description box below. But these were $2.99. Next, I picked up this plain red hairband. I kind of like wanted to wear this on maybe a day like today where I'm wearing a red lip, red nails, you know, white. I just thought around the pool, I don't want to like completely mess my hair up, but around the pool. Ooh. <laughs> and on holiday, I'm all about keeping my hair at my face, especially when it's really hot. I can't stand having like hair around my face so i just thought this was really different it's got a knot at the front and it's like this really gorgeous silk material and it's almost the exact color of my nails and that is just really very satisfying if i do say so oh so, what is that piece of hair doing <laughs> this one was 4.99 i picked up this head scarf so this bit goes like on top of your head and obviously this bit goes at the back um, again, I did another little Instagram makeup video with, with this as well and did like a look around this. I love like a tropical print at the moment, as you can probably tell from my like banner on my YouTube. I just think it's so fresh and summery. I feel like hair accessories can almost just make you look a little bit more glam when you haven't put that much effort in. One of those days you just can't really be bothered to do anything with your face. You know what I mean? And last but not least, I picked up these really delicate little earrings. I'm obsessed with accessories at the minute. I love earrings. I really do think they can just make you look so much more glam. Also, speaking of gorgeous jewellery, one of my best friend Tiffany's has actually just started selling like beautiful earrings and you know those jeweled headbands that everyone loves at the moment I'm actually selling those at the moment so i'm going to link her website in the description box below there's been a few vlogs where i've been actually wearing some of the earrings that she sells and everyone's like where are your earrings from so i'm going to link her page in the description box below so you can go and have a look through all of her products they are incredible i like the perfect holiday jewelry you know like big sparkly jewelry you guys are gonna love them so we have reached the end of episode one of my holiday series i really hope you guys have enjoyed it don't forget episode two will be on sunday at 10 i can't wait for you to see it thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for just being the best friends in the entire world i love you guys so much i hope you're as excited for this little series as i am i hope you have an amazing week and weekend and i'll see you on sunday bye Oh, did you remember?